stands between her and the gold medal. And this is Maria Butraskaya, 28 years of age. A world champion at 26 back in 1999. Can she emulate that feat? Her free program is to the music of 17 Moments in Spring, a Russian movie soundtrack. Maria would really want an Olympic medal. Triple flip. accomplished technician but she's also accomplished in relaying emotions to the audience triple looks double toe the Russian movie this comes from Belinda tells the story of a Russian spy against Nazi Germany in the Second World War in her movements. Triple toe half loop, triple salco. Not quite a triple triple combination, but that's described as a sequence. And here would be the second Lutz on its way. That's only a double. stiffness in it sometimes like coming into these jumps like her arms are a little bit stiff she clenches a fist before she does triple jumps and even though the jumps always turn out quite well there's an element for me of stress that you don't find with either slit sky or quan There's a coach in Russia who would be somewhat red-faced now. Her teenage coach said she had no talent and told her to go elsewhere and try another sport. Stepping up to a double axle, just hangs on to that. Just doesn't appear to show the grace, for example, of a Michelle Kwan. Oh, it's a different style. I think that Maria is incredibly mature and graceful. It's just, uh, for me, not quite the same as Michelle, and that's going to be different to viewers who see that completely opposite it becomes a personal choice and that's partly why you do have nine judges sitting there great combination spin but she does convey the emotion she does get the job done she's a worthy world champion and she's happy with her skate Maria Butraskaya wants to eventually work as a choreographer you just wonder if perhaps Salt Lake City may be her swan song 
The Olympics is always a fantastic motivator for a reason to go on, to go through all of the hard work and the, the tears and the physical exertion. And the good times and the fun. <laughs> Evgeny Kleshenko has fun. Does Certainly quadruples does. for fun. Yeah, that's real fun. Hmm. She just went over to her coach, Elena Chukovskaya. Was there enough in that program to overtake Michelle Kwan? That is the question. The judges behind her. Well, even Sarah Hughes. Well, yes. Here we are setting up for the flip. Right toe into the ice, right toe landed. Well, that was a very smooth jump. And here is the Lutz entry, outside edge, toe dig, triple, and just a little stiff there, landing, and good toe. Here we come into the triple toe, the half loop in between, little outside the circle and pulled it back in to the triple salco. That shows great presence of mind. And her layback spins, the entry isn't so elegant, but the end position is extremely so. And her finishes, everything's always polished, every finish. That's a lady on stage. <laughs> the marks for technical merit. Five three. Better than Nicodinos. Seven. Are they comparable to Sarah Hughes? Can she go back on the podium? Five six. Five six. Five six. Five seven, five six, five three, five seven, five seven, five six. Crowd would like more. Yeah, for very mixed reception there. What about presentation? Does a great following. Well, they're higher. Five nine. Where five, is this? Five, no. five, One, nine, two, three five, thirds. Seven, they're five, fourths. Seven, There's four fourths five, six, and two seconds. That's five, a mixed seven, bag of results. Five, eight, She's very disappointed. Five, but 